What's up, everyone? Tim Alman Jr. here. Milam Asylum Alcohol. Ooh. Watching some anime right now. No, not hentai. My clothes are on. Let's see, I wasn't doing this video. Bottomless. You guys thought I might blur it out the bottom. Anyway, um. It's a it's a pretty good anime. It's really funny. I like the humor. Um, fairy tale. I think I, you just heard it. Anyways, today I got uh, something I've been wanting to try for a while, and I haven't had the pleasure of uh, trying this uh, product. Incline Cider Company. I follow them on my Instagram, and then I slid all up in their DM and asked them how I can acquire their uh, product because I haven't seen it anywhere. Um, and I finally have found it in a select in select stores. And again, oh, it's fucking dirty. Fucking rat shit in there, some shit. It's all right. Survive a coronavirus, I can survive anything. No, I didn't have it. If it was real, I didn't have it. It's fake. Nobody had it. That works. <coughs> really good anime though. It's pretty fucking cool. Anyways, um, Incline Cider Company, 6.9% alcohol per volume in a 19.2 fluid ounce can. This is white peach. Um, Hundred percent fresh press apples, family owned, gluten free, and no added sugar. Uh, it's from Auburn, Washington. Quality craft cider. So these people are about quality. Well, this flavor tester is going to give all about quality. A review. Um, in case you guys are wondering, I have no fucking clue what any of these mean. Uh, bricks, 2.6. pH, 3.4. VL, 1.9. Um, so if any of you guys know what these are, you can leave me a comment. And I think pH is like the balance. See, I could be wrong. It makes sense to me. Um, so this this here, it, it's uh, it's actually got hops in it. So it's fermented fresh apples, apple juice. Sorry, peach juice, white peach extract. And hops. This here was three ninety nine, so it was four bucks. Well, four oh four. No, wait, sorry, four oh nine. Sorry, I forgot. I keep thinking to pause. I haven't turned cans in, in like ten years, so I don't fucking know. Um, so, um, they're pretty cool. A lot, a lot of their um, if you follow them on Instagram. Or anything they have a lot of cool advertisement um, for their product like in the snow and shit like this will be sitting on like a stump in the snow with big ass fucking mountain behind them um, they do a lot of cool fucking promos for it so like I said I slid up in their DMs like balls deep up in those DMs and asked how I can acquire it because like I said I couldn't find it anywhere and they never messaged me back. 
So right there, I should give you guys a fucking zero because what kind of company doesn't want to sell their brand? Huh. Doesn't want to make any money. So anyways, fuck your guys' um, crew, whoever's running all that, because I still haven't gotten a message back from you guys. It's been like a year, I think, or two. Anyways, let's go and crack this open. Let's give you guys your review. Incline. A very interesting smell. Like, it's something completely original. I'm going to see if I can't pull the flavors from it. See what I can, see what I can come up with. Hmm. So, I can actually smell the hops. I can smell the hops in here. Hmm. I can smell peach. And I'm getting a sour smell as well. So, I smell hops, I smell peach, and a sour. I am not getting any apple flavor from this um, at all, but it is white peach. Oh, here we go for the flavor test. Hmm. Okay, I wouldn't buy it, not for the price, flavor. Um, there's plenty of other stuff out there, much better. Um, if you want to support your local brewery, this would be the one, Auburn, Washington. Um, other than that, I, I go with something else. You can get your money's worth and a better product. Um, quality needs to come off the thing. Maybe put like a Washington Craft Cider. Hand Craft Cider. Uh, definitely not quality. So, I mean, I think people are very biased when it comes to their products. Like, if I tried something that I made and it tasted like shit, but I was like, I'm going to sell it anyways. I'm definitely not going to scam anybody. I'm not going to put quality or the best or say it tastes like white peach. If it doesn't taste anything like fucking peach, I'm going to tell you it tastes like piss. Tastes like someone shit in your mouth. Tastes like someone spit in it. Tastes like someone whatever. I'm not going to lie on my product. <laughs> to sell it to you guys. I'm going to call it like I see it. If it tastes like piss, that's the name of it. It tastes like shit in your mouth, that's the name of it. Be honest. You guys didn't put any quality into this product. That's just a fact. Nobody can drink it and go, oh, it's really fucking good. Because it's not. It's not. So, qu quantity. You guys put quantity in it. You mass produce it. But your guys' advertisements, killing it. Your product, no. Nobody's going to be buying this shit. And a select few that do, it must be a quiet taste. But that's only white peach, you guys. So, everybody, white peach, incline, will not buy again, and I don't recommend. And I'm giving it a 6.8 for flavor. Middle of the road, a little high than I normally would give. But it ain't bad. But it is not good. And I would pass it up and buy something else. Um, 
But anyways, that's your guys' review. Thanks for tuning in. Now fuck off.